Welcome everyone to Friday Night Lads in New Orleans, Louisiana. And man, we are so excited to be here with you all. Thank you all for coming out because we have an exciting night for everyone and it's going to get interesting. Welcome everyone and thank you all for coming to Friday Night Lads. The GM has decided that there will only be two matches tonight. It's very sad to see that Monday night is getting more love than Friday, but there's really nothing that we can do about it. Sorry, folks. Anyways, those matches will include a standard one-on-one -on -one match and a tag team match. For our first match, we have the two big-headed rivals, Nick the Iron Eagle Mason, going up against the hothead, Riley Jones, in a one-on-one -on -one match to set the scores from the Moisty Rumble match. If you guys missed out on that match, basically what happened was that Riley Jones came into that match and had one target on his mind, and that was Nick Mason. Once he got into that ring, he instantly went for Nick, eliminating him from the match. Riley Jones did not win that match, but there was indeed heat in the air. That's why we have these heat waves. The social media was blowing up with toxic just messages popping out everywhere. It was brutal. And tonight, they're going to be settling the score in that match to see who's really victorious. For our last match of the day, we have the team of Alex Tews and Austin Knoll going up against Team Twitch themselves, the internet sensations, Pops and Jakey T. This match should be a good one since Pops and Jakey T were in the Moisty Rumble match for the longest. We do have a message to display to you guys tonight as one of our superstars, Big Benny B, has something to say to everyone before these matches get underway. Let's take a look. Hey Moisty Lads Universe, this is Big Benny B coming at you, and I'd just like to say a couple things about Friday night. First of all, I want to congratulate Zachary Snyder, aka Turtles, on becoming the first ever and new Friday Night Lads champion. Congratulations, man. Secondly, I'd like to thank our GM for all the faith and support you had in me in that match. I'm sorry I let you down. But that's something I want to talk to you about. I want to talk to you about getting an opportunity of being the number one contender for the Friday Night Lads Championship. I think out of the whole entire roster, I deserve it the most. I started the, the Royal Rumble match at entrant number two, and I finished all the way to the final four. I mean, I was in there for ten minutes. Not too many people in that match can say that. I thought really hard in that match, pretty much the entire time actually. I mean, even the time I went to take a break in the match, Zachary just attacked me and got me back up and fighting again, and I still kicked his ass without a break, without a breather. Um, and I mean, I really did a great job in that match. I barely gave anyone an opportunity to eliminate me. And I mean, come on. I was busted open for that entire match. But throughout the entire match, I made it seem like my, my head wasn't even bleeding out at all. So, GM of Friday Night Lads, if you really have the faith in me of becoming the Friday Night Lads champion, give me an opportunity this Friday night in the main event for a number one contendership match for the Friday Night Lads championship. See you guys then, hopefully, in the main event. Wow. Let's hope that the GM is watching because Big Benny B just called out the Friday Night Lads champion. I mean... I wanted Big Benny B to win that match. In my opinion, I think he should have won that match. But I guess he did because my predictions never come true. So, sorry Ben, if I really counted on you there. But GM, if you're watching, let's make a deal. My job for that match. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> Anyways, let's get on to our first match of the night. Nick Mason versus Riley Jones. This match is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from North Carolina, the Iron Eagle himself, Nick Mason. Welcome home, Nick Mason. In last week's match, Nick came in strong, but when his opponent tonight stepped foot into that ring, chaos erupted, as Nick wasn't even watching his back 
to the point where you could call his opponent a hitman. Nick wasn't happy about that, so he took it to social media to call him out. And tonight, they find out who's better, a hothead or the Iron Eagle. Champions never die, I'm ready for whatever The pressure's my pleasure, the pain I treasure Cause I come back way better, don't hate it cause I made it Been patient And his opponent, from Pennsylvania, Riley Jones And here comes Hothead Jones Nobody really calls them that, but when you decide to just target one person in a match and think you're better, that's what I like to call a hothead. Now Riley is one of the dirtiest competitors out here. He will attack you when you're not looking. He's like a demon, but it's just Riley. He's looking to step up to the Iron Eagle to claim the bragging rights that he is in fact better than the Eagle. And here we go, starting Friday night off with a good match. Looks like Nick's gonna capitalize with a suplex into a cover. No, early kick out there. Obviously we're gonna see that. What is Nick doing here? Oh my God, the strike and a power bomb. Military power bomb to Riley. I was like, Nick is just going to be just completely capitalizing on this match. After that match from last week, I'm pretty sure he's gonna be pretty furious. And an elbow to Riley. Uh oh, what are we gonna be seeing here? And a step over by Nick. Wow. Once again, just Nick is capitalizing on this match. He is taking control over this whole thing. And what are we gonna be seeing here? Ooh, an elbow strike and another elbow strike. Dropping him into a cover. No, kick out at two. Here we go. Nick getting Riley up. Are we going to be seeing here in a right hook to Riley? Are we going to be seeing another power bomb? Ooh, multiple headshots to Nick as Riley takes a spear! Spear to Nick! Oh my god, Riley is back into this match. Ooh, and a kick, uh-oh, right into the arm lock, and what a headbutt by Nick. Here we go. What is this? Oh my god, a shoulder toss. Here we go, Nick going to be getting Riley's shoulder. Here we go, Nick, uh oh, he's got Riley up and a toss from behind. Just incredible strength displayed by Nick. And here we go, another step over. That's gotta do a lot of damage. What is this, what is he doing? Oh my God, the strength of this man lifting Riley up into the air and it's gonna be a drop. Military press drop. Incredible strength provided here. Oh, and Riley gets a counter. Here we go, Riley capitalizes with a slam. Uh oh, off the ropes and a sliding leg brace or whatever that was. Here we go, Riley's gonna try to capitalize on here. Into the corner, what is it gonna be happening? Uh oh, thrown into the corner, Nick tries to get out of the way and no! A massive drop kick to the gut of Nick. Uh-oh, what are we gonna be seeing here? Oh, massive dirty DDT. Oh my God, a kick out at two, that should have been it. Riley should have won. Here we go, Riley's not happy about this. Ooh, backflip to the back of Nick. Uh-oh, he's targeting the arm of Nick. Oh my God, and Nick with a counter. Multiple headshot strikes. Here we go. Nick getting Riley up. Ooh, wanted to go for something. Ooh, multiple punches right back and forth. Here we go. Nick getting him up in the air. Here we go, one arm. And a drop. Big suplex there to a cover. No, kick out at two. You're gonna have to do more than that, Nick. Ooh, strike to the head. 
Ooh, multiple shots to the face of Riley. Trying to make him bleed here. And a, no, that had to hurt that hand. Tried to go for another shot. Uh oh, roundabout DDT. And here we go. Looks like Riley Jones is going to be taking the capitalization here. No, a counter by Nick. Oh, but lands into a right left hook. And oh, another counter by Nick. Uh oh, here we go. Riley is facing the wrong way. What are we going to be seeing here? Ooh, last ride into a cover. Oh my God, another kick out. Another kick out, that should have been it. How, how are these men just completely just kicking out of these? Uh-oh, we've seen this already. The strength of Nick. He still has it. He's not tired at all and a drop to Riley Jones. Uh-oh, gonna be targeting the leg. Ooh. Oh, another one. And a third one to the thigh of Riley. And a missed drop kick. Oh my god, I thought that was gonna be it. Uh-oh, what is this? Big DDT! Big DDT. That must have been fatal right there. But Riley is not done. He's going to keep going. But what is this? Is he gonna be looking for a pin? He's gonna get him to turn over, and here we go, a cover! No, only two. I think the ref took long. That must have been the ref's fault. That looked a little bit too long of a pin. That should have been three right there. But it looks like Riley is going to end it once again right here with a massive dirty DDT to the cover. This could be it. And that's it. Here is your winner, Riley Jones. In that match, it went so many ways that you could have thought that Nick would have won, but actually it was the opposite. Riley took the W and now has the best bragging rights of his life. He did what he did and he took out the Iron Eagle once again. There was so much going on in that match that I didn't even have a second to think of who was going to win that match. Riley Jones comes out victorious and now has the biggest bragging rights over what happened last week. But right now before our next match begins, a special someone has something to say. What is up, Moisey Lads Universe? So I heard Big Benny Diaz called me out. He fought very well in our Royal Rumble match, but unfortunately, he didn't make it like I did. I won. I'm the champion. You already know. The other person that put up a great fight was Jake. Jake fought amazingly. So I want to congratulate him for his efforts. Now, Benny, I have a preposition for you. If you beat Jake in a main event match, you can have your title shot against me in an Extreme Rules match. I'm looking forward to this. Benny, I hope you win. Even though our GM didn't respond, it looks like our champion, Zack Snyder, AKA the Turtle, has just responded to Benny B's request. And it looks like Zack wants Ben to earn that shot, kinda like how John did over on Monday night. Guess we will be hearing from Ben later tonight, or the GM, you never know. But anyways, let's get right into our second and final match of the night. Hopefully we will end this on a good note. This match is a tag team match, making his way to the ring from Pennsylvania, Alex Tooze. You know, during the Moisty Rumble match, Tooze and Noel were both very aggressive on their attacks, but sadly, they were both eliminated because their offense had no defense. But this ain't no Moisty Rumble no more. I feel like their offensive attacks will weaken their opponents tonight, and they will come out on top for once in their careers.
partner, making his way to the ring. From an ice rink in some part of Canada, Austin Knoll. And here comes the American-Canadian, Austin Knoll. He fought very well during the Moisty Rumble match, especially coming out as one of the two starters. He lasted some time, but was eliminated by Jaden, not even before number five came out. But he's ready for his first match that isn't an elimination. Alex and Noel both trained in the gym to figure out what kind of chemistry they had. And I can't tell you if they found it or not, but they had some time to find it. So we will have to see what they bring to the table during this match. Presenting Pops and Jakey T. Pops! And this is a star that I was waiting to commentate for. From internet sensation to maybe a Moist Slats Hall of Famer, Pops. His son Jakey T also followed him into the business. And let's just say, they have skill. Now you wouldn't think that they could do what every superstar can do. But let me tell you that they are both phenomenal athletes. Even for Pops' age. They are here to start their journey, and they won't stop until they are champions. People should fear this team. Jakey T! Jakey T! Jakey T has landed and is here to save the day, or should I say, night. Him and his father, Pops, are ready to take on this match to the extreme as they wanted to put a name out for themselves. Oh, what's this? Pops just gave me a note. This note reads, Please subscribe to Pops and Jakey T on YouTube and follow their Twitch stream. Hey, no self-promoting, Pops! I'm gonna have to say this for later. The tag match has started, here we go. Ooh, Alice with a nasty right hook to Pops. Lifting Pops up into the air, and a running body slam, going for a cover. Look at that, it's a two count already. Pops is so old that he doesn't even have the strength for that, but somehow kicks out. Way to go, Pops. Here we go, ooh, lands right into another right hook, and just completely, brutally hitting Pops. Uh oh, off the ropes to the back. He's old, come on, Alex. Oh, here we go. Alex is taunting on Pops right now. And a tag has been made. Noel is into the match. Here we go. Here we go, Pops. Is oh my god! Noel just throws him over the top rope and onto the floor. That was so dangerous. So I'm thankful that Pops got up. Here we go. Pops still has the energy to run with that. Oh my god. Uh oh, should not be emoting right in front of Pops. Pops is gonna bring him to the corner. 
Ooh, head first right into that corner. Uh oh, what is Pops looking to do? Ooh, another slam to the corner and a slap by Pops. There we go. Oh my God, another head slam into that corner. Ooh, and a nice right hook to the chest. And a stomp by Pops. Uh oh, some face slashes. This is gonna do some damage. Pops is getting Noel up. What's he gonna do here? Uh oh. Pops is gonna bring him somewhere. He's gonna bring him right back into that corner. He is not going anywhere. Ooh, and a counter by Noel. Noel is on the offensive now. What is he gonna be doing here? And a, ooh, a side toss. Uh oh, Jacob wanted to go for a tag, but it looks like Noel just wanted to get Pops up by himself. Uh oh, is Noel gonna bring him over to his corner? Oh, he's wasting time, and Pops gets out of that. Nasty elbows to the gut of Noel. And Pops looking for multiple body shots. Oh, multiple body shots and a nice uppercut. And a tag has been made, and another tag has been made. Both people are back in. Oh, my God, did you hear that slap? You could hear that across the stadium. Oh, my God, again. Another slap by Jacob and a counter by Alex. No more slaps. Alex is looking to break the arm of Jakey T. Oh my God, just massively just going right for the arm. That must do a lot of damage right there. Uh oh, what's this? He's going for the arm again. The bad arm is the submission. Oh, what's gonna happen here? Jacob needs to get out of this. And oh, he gets out. And a knee to the face of Alex. Jakey T on the shoulder, it's on the shoulders. And a, ooh, big slam. Jacob wants him to get tagged, and in comes Noel. Here we go, Noel onto the aggress. Ooh, right on the ropes. Here we go, Noel gets him up, and a big knee to the face with a cover. And only one. Uh-oh. Ooh, ow, did you hear that? I heard some bones crack. That must have hurt. And once again, off the top rope to the face of Jakey T. Here we go. Just targeting Jakey T. Just completely, just massive damage to his body. Uh-oh. What's this? No. No, that's the gamer hand. Oh, my God. He's breaking the gamer hand. Ooh. Just so much damage is being brought to Jacob. Uh-oh. No. No, not again. No, that's the other hand. Oh, my God. Another gamer hand down. And once again, knees to the back. How is JKT going to stream? I guess there's going to be no stream tonight. Uh-oh. But he caught him in a... Ooh, backflip to a knee. To a knee. JKT is back into this match. Multiple hits to Noel. Uh-oh. Here we go, Jakey T, bring him to the corner, and a, ooh, big shot, multiple body shots, and a jumping 360 kick. Oh, just, uh-oh, Noel, he was going to go for some face slashes, but Noel gets the counter, throws him to the ground. Here we go, Noel with the cover. And Pops breaks it up. Pops for the save, uh-oh. But here goes Pops, over the top rope, and there goes Pops. Looks like Pops is out. Uh oh, but Jakey T has no on his shoulders. What's gonna happen here? Right under those ropes. That's gonna do some serious damage. And what's this? Big gamer splash! Oh my god. Just brutally attacking him. Wow! Oh my god! A backflip and a cover! No! Noel kicks out. Here we go, Jakey T is gonna get a back kick to Noel. As we see, Pops is just brutally attacking Alex on the outside. It looks like Jakey T though, he's setting up for something. What is Jakey T setting up for? Uh-oh, hop over and a leap. What is it, he's going for it. The W lock, he's got it in. The W lock, it's in. Will Noel tap, Noel taps, Noel taps. He taps, it's over. Here are your winners, Pops and Jakey T!
The Twitch team has won it. Pops and Jakey T are out here to dominate, and they just provided every other team with an example tonight. The father-son duo is a nasty team that you do not want to go up against. And with that all being said and done, thank you all for watching Friday Night La- What the hell? Hello, everyone. I am the GM. I hope you all are enjoying Friday Night Lads. I know I have. I've been watching since the start. And Robert, you won't lose your job. Because I wasn't going to put this match in. But something happened. I was, for once in my life, convinced to doing this. I was sent a video that really inspired me to change my mind. Now, as you've seen with all of these videos, I've gotten a video that takes courage and determination. This is that video. Hey, Moisty Lads Universe, this is Big Betting B coming at you with a response to Zachary Snyder's proposal for the championship match. I totally will take on Jake the Snake in the main event tonight to become the number one contender for the Friday Night Lads Championship. I think him and I were in the same situation in that match. I think we'd make a great main event. I started at, at number two, he was number three, and then he just got eliminated right before me. So I think we'd make a great main event match, and I can't wait to become the number one contender for the Friday Night Lights Championship. And I'll take you on in any type of match, Zach. I was going to propose a two out of three falls match like they did back in the old days when they had to do championship matches. But Extreme Rules will be just as huge of a main event championship match for us. And it'll be just as hard of a challenging of a battle. I can't wait to see you in an Extreme Rules match where I will become the new Friday Night Lads champion. I know what you all think this is. But to me, it's someone who really wants that chance at the title. To agree to a match like this, and then hopefully winning to go on to an Extreme Rules match that takes guts, because anything, and I mean anything, can happen during that match. So I'm going to allow Big Benny B and Jake the Snake fight tonight. And if Big Benny B wins, he will get that main event match for the Friday Night Lads title next week in an Extreme Rules match against the Friday Night Champion, Zack the Turtle Snyder. So what are we waiting for? Let's give these people one more match. This match is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Homeland, Pennsylvania. He is the biggest bee on earth, Big Benny B. I can't believe that the GM has finally answered his call. Benny B gets a shot at the title. Well, he's got to win this match, of course. Ben was looking forward to doing it tonight, but the champ had other plans for him. But Ben doesn't back down from a fight. He will step into the ring with anyone to get this shot at the Friday Night Last Championship. I can't believe I'm saying this again, but go Benny B! Go Benny B! from Rattlesnake County, Texas, Jake the Snake. And here comes the Viper himself. The Rattlesnake is here to help the champion defend that title. 
If Jake wins, all of Ben's dreams will disappear, and he will never get a shot at the title. Let's see if the aggression of his Viper instincts will help him succeed and win this match against Big Benny B. Ladies and gentlemen, the match of a lifetime. Big Benny B versus Jake the Snake. If Benny B wins, he gets his shot at the Friday Night Lads champion himself, Zachary Snyder. But if Jake wins, Ben's dreams are crushed. As Jake is on the aggression here and is choking Ben out from the top rope. That strength to just lift him up by the neck has to do so much damage. Oh, and an arm lock here, trying to break that arm. Ooh. That must have done some damage right there as well. Uh-oh. And already a submission. Submission to Benny B. Is this going to make Ben tap? I hope not. Uh, ben powers out of it. Ooh, nasty right hooks to the face of Jake the Snake. Here we go. Ben on the aggression. What's Ben going to be doing? Ben throws Jake right off the top rope. And once again, Ben now onto the attack for the arm. Right back at you, Jake. Uh-oh. What's this? Flip over the head, breaking that neck. Uh-oh. Jake gets out of it. Ooh! Nasty drop kick to Ben. Uh-oh. A takedown. Looks like Jake has the opportunity here. Ooh! Nasty knee to the face. That's going to do some damage. And right back to the arm of Benny B. If Jake breaks that arm... That could really do some damage and could end Ben's career for a little bit. Ooh, but Ben with the counter. He gets out of it. Ben is back under the aggression. Ben, big slam. Ben gets him back up and a right hook to the chest. Uh oh, Ben has Jake on the shoulders. What's, go what's he going to do? Ooh, and Jake gets out of it in time before he gets thrown out of the ring. Ooh. And, uh, oh my god, Ben on the aggression. He really wants this title shot. He does not care. Ooh, knee to the gut. Uh-oh, Ben here. He's getting for it. Oh, and right back to the arm. It is two for two with these arms. Uh-oh, and once again, a flip over the head with a neck breaker. And another counter by Jake right after that. Uh-oh, what's this? What is he looking for? Ooh, double knees to the face. That must have done some damage to that forehead that Ben just recovered from after match. Oh, my God. Nasty downwards. Hey, uh-oh. Big slam. That might be it. Will this be it? No, Ben kicks out. Ben kicks out after that. But the look in the eyes of Jake... Jake's getting Ben up. Is he going for it? No! Ben gets out of it! Ben with the Superman dive and misses because Jake blocks. Uh-oh. Jake after the arm again. Another arm breaker. Oh, my God. He's getting those arms worked up because Ben won't be able to use anything. He won't be able to lift them or anything. Oh, nice elbow to the back. Uh-oh. Oh, once again, targets the arms of Benny B. Uh-oh. Benny didn't like that. Nasty right hook. Uh-oh. What's Ben looking for here? The Benny Bomb. Goes for the cover. That is a rope break. The ref called it off. I can't believe it. That was an incredible. This is the turn of events here. Ben with the shoulder slam. Goes for a cover. Oh, and Jake grabs the ropes. Another rope break. Ben can't believe it. He's so mad. I can see it in his eyes right now. Uh-oh. Ben getting him back up. Is he going for another one? He's going for it again! Benny Bomb! This could be it! This could be the win! Then that's it! Benny gets the championship match! Here is your winner, Big Benny B! My 
my god, I can't believe this. Ben gets his match that he wanted since the end of the Moisty Rumble. He's done it, ladies and gentlemen. I can't believe this. Benny B is going to fight Zachary Snyder next week. And John's going to be fighting Skulls. I just realized. Oh my god, and I just realized that my curse has been broken. I can vote for whoever I want. This is amazing. This is literally only on MLW. <laughs> Oh my god, I need to call my mom after this. <laughs> Anyways guys, thank you all for showing up. Thank you all for coming. Thank you all for watching at home. My name was Robert Davidson. This was Friday Night Lads. We will be seeing you next week. Next Monday and next Friday. And we will be seeing who will be crowned either the new or who remains as both the Monday night and Friday night champions. And maybe we can get some other matches in there. Maybe some crazy matches. But yeah, thank you all for coming. Thank you to the GM for giving Ben that opportunity. Thank you for, to the GM for not firing me. <laughs> Anyways, thank you all for coming out once again. You guys have been awesome. We'll be seeing you all later. Goodbye. Crazy guys, goodbye, Big Rogers, goodbye, everyone. This was Friday night. Best to me now, best to me now, best to me.